Well, what's up everybody? This is Freaky Phil and welcome back to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. This is part 9 of my journey. Searching for the witch Siri in a quarrel with, Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. Sorceress told the Witcher about a masked mage. Siri had seemed to taken shelter in his hideout. The Witcher set off to find it, with Kira in tow. Okay, everybody, so if you remember last time, um, we go down here and we end up in front of uh, what I can only describe as pure evil. Um, it's uh, a wild hunt warrior. So right now I'm gonna have to meditate um, because we're all really low on health and I've got nothing left. Uh, this guy is extremely powerful. Um, I finished the last video being beaten to death by this guy. Let's uh, hope we can do a bit better. You're stubborn, Dwan. Geralt, I shall help you. Step back. Stop telling me what to do. I wonder how long you love. Two big swings in on him. It's just hard to see him. It's dark. Come on, right? Yeah. Yeah. Shut up, Vodka! Shut up, Vodka! Boy, Lodge, Vodka! Shut up, Vodka! Come on. Go, right. look! He's opening a puzzle! We've done him. We're gonna do him. Oh my god! 
I serve thee. Let's look around. If I've my knuckles on straight, this looks like the elves' laboratory. Ladies and gentlemen, we have done it. We get a meteorite, silver plate, diamond dust, steel plate, diagram for a Angrenayan, curious, curious, sorry, wild hunt warrior sword. Oh. That has got to be the hardest bo ba boss battle I've fought in any game for a very long time. Alright, let's watch this message. Here, this place is no longer safe. Do not tarry here long. Trust no one. And above all, beware the witches of Crookback Bog. Try to reach the place where last we were together. Where last we were together? Not much to go on. Damn it. Perhaps it's best he didn't leave a clearer message. The Wild Hunt broke in here, surely they saw the projection. They searched everything, and if they had more time they'd probably have torn the place to the ground. But that doesn't change the fact that we haven't learned anything. Not about the Elf, not about Ciri. Well, we know they were well acquainted, and travelling together. Wonder why they split up. Perhaps because the Wild Hunt was on the Elf's trail. And Siri would be safer if they did. The witches of Crookback Swamp. Crookback Bog. Kira, if you're hiding something. But I didn't say. Why didn't you say anything earlier? I told you Siri had a run in with a witch. Well, I had no idea you meant them. If I'd told you something, you would have rushed off to find them. But we needed first to confirm that Siri was here, didn't we? I shall tell you everything now, of course. Now? After I safely led you through the cave? I can't believe you'd think so poorly of me. Perhaps you do bear a grudge against sorceresses. Mm-hmm. Can't imagine where that comes from. You know these witches? I've never met them, but I've read of them. In an old manuscript I found in one of the huts in the village. It mentions the village witches venturing into Crookback Bog at times to liaise between the villagers and the crones, the ladies of the wood. The crones appear to be intolerant of outsiders, but they help the local folk. Apparently, they stop the spread of the plague in Bellum. Hmm. What's your take on this? I'd love to shrug it off as the nattering of so many old women, yet... Throughout my first fortnight in Velen, I had horrible nightmares. Something was calling me out into the swamps. One night, I decided to enter the dream consciously. Render it lucid. I confronted the thing directly. It broke contact at once. Peaceful nights ever since. How do I find them? The swamps are vast. Dangerous. But they say the crones mark the way for peasants who wish to visit them. The manuscript mentions a chapel in Crookback Bog. And from that chapel, one must follow a trail of treats. Treats? Of course. They didn't read you bedtime stories at Care Morgan. All normal folk know that witches live in gingerbread houses poised atop chicken legs. I'll have to see that to believe it. Take the tome and read it. I... I truly do believe you'll find your Cirilla. All right then. As a start, let's look for a way out of here. Good idea. Why is a bag that? Why do we even come? Journalist. No, they still there. Strange. My medallion's trembling, but there's nothing here. What's with this wall? It's an illusion. I sensed it as well. I expected we might run into such things, so I brought this. Meaning what? The Eye of Nahalani. It dispels illusions. It's easy enough to build, so you're welcome to this one. It's bound to come in handy. And each time it does, 
you will think of me. <laughs> Thanks. Thought of yourself and your sweetheart. Have you notice a shimmer in the air will toward you when you are close with Annie to dispel the illusion? Let's see where the passage leads. Do you feel that? A flow of fresh air from the left must be an exit that way. Good. Let's get out of here. Wait, there's still the magic lamp. The magic what now? Lamp. The elf promised it to me in exchange for my help. And since his return here seems doubtful, I must retrieve it myself. If I can find it, that is. Will you help? Oh my god. Yeah, I'll help. Splendid. Come then. Gavella Glam. We're certain to find something here. It looks like another damned riddle to me. Oh. oh my nanny's dog. Two my nanny's dog. That one's got a oh, good nuke. Fuck it. Oh, this one. good at the high variant of the Elder Speech. Hmm. All right. This might seem a bit literal. I'm afraid I can't replicate its sophisticated internal rhymes. Just translate it to make sense. Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first to light his fire dared not march on the end. The second, by the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet, like the second, played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen. Easy! Who slept beneath flickering stars. Hmm. <laughs> Sounds like a riddle, all right. Easy peasy. All right. Let's see if we can solve this. Alright, so that means that dude, then the guy with the loot in his hand, and then uh, this one over here. No. This one. And then the other one. Because he's got a loot as well as a dog. There we go. Way up there. Get this lit. Whose grave is it? What do you think? No inscription, sadly. <sighs> Sign of the go. If 
I didn't already know where she was buried, I'd guess this is Laura Doran's sepulcher. Perhaps it's a monument to her. Can't see the elves commemorating her this way. Heroine of a tragic legend to some, but... Most see her as a traitor to her race, who got her just desserts for marrying Kragenin of Laud. Perhaps the elven mage is Lara's kin. It would explain why he's helping Ciri. Possible. This what you're looking for? Uh-huh. So what's it supposed to do? Hmm. I hope I'll be able to activate it. Let's leave this place, shall we? worth it, right? You learned something about Ciri in the end. Something important. Do you intend to venture into Crookback Bog? You must tell me about it afterwards. Don't know that I'll get the chance. Geralt, there are two types of men. Those who see opportunity and take advantage, and those who forge the opportunities themselves. I've always seen you as an example of the latter. Besides, I've a favor to ask you. So, visit me sometime? I'll stop by, you can be sure. In that case, I shall be waiting. See ya, Kira. <laughs> Girl in slank. She's gone now. <laughs> I'm gonna search for the Penner's Hut, apparently. And here they are. <laughs> <laughs> Going in. Fucking bastard! <laughs> 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 
Let's do this. Get him! Come on! Oh, you're still hot! Yeah! Hey there, Scabies. Spears wandered our way. Shut up, freak. I need it. What do you want? Want to talk to the Peller? Too late. We've got dibs on a chat with him. A long one. What do you want from him? To give him what he deserves. And that is? He done conjured Alkiris. Said something evil had made its nest in Edric's bowels. Told Edric to eat rowan berries. Lots of them. Ever since Edric's lived in the outhouse. And he's got hardened pustules all over him. Just so happens I need the Peller alive. So if you agree to leave him alone, for good, I'm willing to tell you how to help Edric. Who the hell do you think you are? A Witcher. A Witcher? Hear that, boys? Either Velen's got a bumper crop of witches, or this is the bastard who cut down our boys at the crossroads! Fall ah! around! Ah! Stand still, dammit! Ah! 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 Gotta wonder about a man who could get Hendrick's friends all worked up. That's right, baby. I don't know what I can do it in here. Hey, anybody home? Open up, it's safe now. Devils? Who do they bring? What seek ye? I need your help. Whoa! A man? Nay, a wolf? Grey, though not old. Tis he the Peller awaits. Expecting me. Aye, as the bones declared I should. They shall come whose stench is rape and death, but the wolf shall disperse them, the white wolf. And thus he comes. Omens never lie. Recognize this? Made of spruce wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. Freshly cut spruce, sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth, smoke and juniper. For Anna, to protect her. You make the amulet? Aye, sure it was the Pella. After the way of his forefathers, over still water in the light of a full moon. Proper as amulets go. It protected well. Should never have taken it off. So, designed to protect her. From what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was, evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic born of oblivion, from dark sources emerged. Old magic? Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm, not a thing more a Pella could do. Anna and her daughter are missing. Know where they are? Nay, no, nay. Pella don't know. But the spirits could know. The Pella will augur, the spirits ask. Spirits? Great. 
Fine with me. As long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? Princess! My goat! She's fled! Those men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Without the goat? Impossible. No goat? <laughs> Won't work. Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess! Princess! Where have you got to, girl? Fine. I'll get your goat. The bell! The little bell's ringing! She loves it! Ring, ring, and she will follow! But for a while. But beware of wild strawberries. Raspberries, too. Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. Bloody hell. <sighs> She's down there. Bullshit. What now? What the f frog eyes, man? Blah. Oh my god! Well, that's all we've got time for at the moment, people. If you like what you saw and you want to see more, don't forget to like, comment, and definitely subscribe if you're new. Please share this around as much as possible. And yeah, just catch up with the next one. In the next one, we're going to be going looking for. Princess the goat and sort it out whatever the Pella wants to do. So catch you in the next one. Peace!